Hello everyone, Silverstruck here. Welcome to the Silverstruck channel. Glad to have you here for a video on stacking premium silver bars. I have a couple new bars recently added to my stack that I would love to share with all of you. But before we get into those new additions, I'd like to talk about what constitutes a premium silver bar versus generic. As you can see, I have some germanium mint silver bars out on the table for display. So let's start with the larger 500 gram bar and we'll talk about what makes this a premium bar. So when we first look at this bar, you can see it has a very nice fit and finish to it. It's a beautiful cast bar, completely wrapped in plastic. On the obverse, it says four nines fine silver. It has the weight stamped, which is 500 grams and then a serial number at the very bottom. As we flip the bar over to its reverse, you can see that it does have a certificate of authenticity. So all of these features added together are one of the reasons why this is a premium bar versus a generic silver bar. Let's have a quick look at a generic bar. Here's a one ounce buffalo bar. You can see it's stamped three nines pure over there to the right of the buffalo. On the reverse, it is just a plain reverse, no certificate of authenticity, no serial number, no date, not that it would need that because it is a bar. Uh, not wrapped in plastic and doesn't have any particular uh, high-end fit and finish associated with it. There's absolutely nothing wrong with stacking generic silver. We're just talking about premium silver in this video. So now that we've had a look at both premium and generic silver. Let me talk a little bit about the germanium mint. The cast germanium mint silver bars are available in multiple sizes. The 500 gram happens to be the second largest they produce. There is a 1000 gram or also known as a kilo bar. But if you don't want to stack in 1000 gram at a time or 500 gram at a time, they make a 250 gram. So 250 grams is about eight ounces of uh, silver, eight troy ounces, while the 500 gram is 16 ounces of four nines pure silver. The smallest bar produced in grams from the germanium mint is this 100 gram bar. This is one of my all time favorites, although I have not stacked as many as I would like. So the 100 gram size is just over 3.2 troy ounces of four nines fine silver. Also, the germanium mint does offer stacking by the ounce. The smallest bar offered in their lineup is a five ounce bar. It has all the same features that you will find on the gram bars. So available in five ounce, 10 ounce, and also 100 ounce. So with as much as I enjoy stacking these germanium mint bars, there are a couple premium bars that I also enjoy stacking, and I was able to pick up a couple really nice ones to share with all of you. So first up is a 100 gram Geiger bar. As you can see on the obverse here, really nice classic design. It's 100 grams of three nines fine silver encased in a certificate of authenticity. And on the reverse, we have a security feature and a serial number. So that all helps uh, this bar become a premium bar as well. Everything combined, the certificate of authenticity, the security feature, and also the serial number. Now the fineness might not be as much as the germanium mint bars are, but three nines fine is definitely a good amount of fineness in silver. Four nines is a little bit better, yes, but I do enjoy stacking uh, the three nines silver as well. I love adding Geiger bars to the stack. So what better than to add, yes, a second 100 gram Geiger bar. So I was very happy to get a good deal on these two bars and add two more to the stack. I was not able to find the 100 gram germanium mint bar, but was able to find the 100 gram Geigers, which I was a little surprised, but also uh, pleased. So that said, 
With premiums so high, it's been more expensive to add silver to the stack. If you follow my channel, you may know I'm trying to fill a large beer stein with 90% silver, and that certainly cuts into the silver bar stacking budget. I would love to hear from you. What silver are you adding to your stack? Don't forget to leave me a comment in the comment section, and as always, thank you so much for watching.